skulls everywhere. It's like skulls and crystals. He loves skulls and crystals. Yes. Actually, that's a lot of fun. Yeah. Now, Carl, you mentioned some things about Damien Hirst. He had the yeah, about what's, his artwork. What's the story? Damien Hirst uses the. Well, we. She was like an artist to collaborate with, okay. just for the line who someone who can kind of take on um, the image that Warhol was creating with his. Okay. Um, just with his artwork. But so, as far as Hearst goes, since he does so much of like the kind of morbid and animal skulls and that kind of thing, it was uh -huh. very appropriate to kind of throw him into this. And um, he did a very good job. I mean, we were very happy with the past. He did three seasons for us. So. Um, oh, that's nice. Yeah, with, for all like the men's where it has um, all the vests and jackets have the front zippers on them. And then, um, these are some unique details with the lines. Yeah, especially like this stitching yeah. here and stuff. And also, a few pieces have the. Oh, this hands is fun. On. How they have the. Drew even had that tattooed on himself. The hand. Really? Yeah. Wow. Is that is a Hearst or a Warhol? That's. I, I don't believe know. a Warhol. Are we? No, I mean. Probably hers because it's his collection. Yeah. That's a cute one. Yeah. And then it kind of, it's all torn up obviously, but the dagger through the heart, they did a few t shirts and things with that image on it. That's too bad this one's torn up. Most it looks beautiful. It had yeah. either the pins or keychains coming out of it of the crystal um, skulls as well. And then and that's the larger. Wow. Um, and there's like a pair of black denim very like skinny straight leg pants that were completely crystallized with like this pretty much this big of skulls on them and it was completely covering the jean like they weighed probably 10 pounds the jeans did well, these are skulls. not your yeah. old levi's that no, you always not. think about that's <laughs> what i love i mean yeah. new... now what is this now this does not look like denim no <laughs> uh, i don't even know how this <clears throat> Bound, so. Is this oh. final? Warhol Factory Levi's. Oh, are these actually? The <laughs> are those? Yeah. With the crystals on the. Now, do those actually work, or that's more? De they look more decorative. Oh yeah. But you never know because Ryan's still encrusted accessories. Uh, yeah, <clears throat> they actually have been using a lot of the headphones. Sold, like, the headphones with, the with the jeans. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's cool. Oh, these are fun. Look at these. There's denim. <laughs> it comes out every once in a while. They actually do have denim in their line. And then moving to the, the um, capital E is the more higher end denim line for Levi's. So the thing with capital E, if you're not already familiar, they're all um, hand stitched, so no two pairs are exactly the same. And that's why they have the higher price point. And, um, aren't sold I mean I guess even like Urban carries them now like 150 them, though, but, yeah so yeah, Levi's you like 150 to 250 they decided to get into the premium denim line mm -hmm. yeah so they they have I mean a full um, range as far as like boot cut wide boot cut straight leg slim straight skinny every um, I mean just every style for khaki. so so there's a so these are all hand stitched. Mm -hmm. You mean um, like machine stitched by hand or literally right. by hand? No, no, not literally. <laughs> no, 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 you know what I mean. And then there's just every season we just get, I mean, a little bit of a variation as far as the washes go. Um, but for the most part, it's not a lot of distression or anything. It's all just um, clean, clean denim look. Yeah. So what are you guys doing for the trend for the fall for denim? Is it, is it more of this darker denim here that's... Yeah, it is. It's a lot of darker denim and...